Alrighty, hey kiddos, welcome back to another episode of Vampire. In the last episode, we met the Escalon Club, and now we I have to question people. I just suggested I was sired by an ancient vampire. Women die too in this war! Good evening, Miss Ashbury. And good evening to you, Dr. Reed. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? A few days ago, I spotted a strange house while campaigning for women's suffrage. Awful smell. No answer when I knocked. Where is it? It's the Mullaney's. A nice family who live in a big house near the park in the eastern part of this neighborhood. Goodbye, Charlotte. Give my best regards to your mother when you see her. She's been quite... Hmm. Uh, so before we do that, we gotta go inside and uh, talk to Lady, this person over here. I like how I can kill Lady Ashbury's kid. That's a choice in this game. Where was it? There was the house over here that I had to go into to talk to Lady about her friend. Not the Lady bitch, but you know who I'm talking about. In the last episode, we couldn't get in there because our mesmerized level was so low. But now we can go in. Her house. Hello again, Venus. Jonathan, you're still up. Can't you just knock at people's doors during the day? I'm sure you can spare me a few minutes. For old time's sake. Of course you may enter, Jonathan. At least you survived the Great War. I fear for the rest. All right. Sorry, I had some ice cream. <clears throat> My throat's a little crazy. <laughs> I know, I should have probably prepared better for recording, but I need a collectible that is in this girl's house. At this hour of night? Oh, so are you sick? You're healthy. Okay, cool. It's a nice house. Holy crap. There it is. Nope, never mind. That's her journal. It's locked, all right. All right. Where's the collectible? It is. Hold on. Give me a second. I don't see it. There's a collectible on the drawer on the left side of the bed. Alright. There it is. Swoosh. No invitation is needed to enter this building. That can't be a good sign. No sign of a struggle. It seems Charlotte's friend knew the killer and let him in. Oh, blood. Emily wanted to become a vampire. Something must have gone wrong. Blood. I should follow the trail. Wow. I'm a I'm gonna assume she's a skell. Maybe? North Dock. Is that her?
Is this you? Who are you? What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. I'm the Marquis de Bois Colomb, and I strongly invite you to find your own game, sir. I'm not here to sustain myself. I'm currently investigating the death of a young woman killed by a vampire. A young woman killed by a vampire? Oh, <laughs> you're joking, right? Oh, I do love the British sense of humor. I followed the trail of blood from her room to here. Oh, you're referring to that young woman. Yes, the meeting turned messy. I'm afraid I ruined my last wedding good. So you admit you murdered her? I admit nothing, my good sir. I only regret the blood of that girl staining my clothes. Oh, blood can be so messy. What happened? She wanted to become one of us. Not the first time I have received such a proposal, but uh, I must admit her direct approach tempted me. And then what? The body rejected my blood. It happens, you know, sometimes even with voluntary prey. At least her gurglings brought me some fun until the artery burst. I believe you, sir. Emily's diary confirms your statement. Oh, Emily was her name. Quite charming. Well, mystery solved then. Yes, I suppose so. You can go. And so can you. Farewell, sir. May you enjoy the spectacle of this fallen city as much as I do. Hmm. Your friend was planning to become a vampire. She thought she'd met an honest one and made a deal with him. Unfortunately, Emily did not survive the process. My mother told me many times about the risks of being turned. I often suspected she exaggerated the danger to avoid me being tempted. No, the risk is real. Have you any idea what a body has to endure to become an organism entirely consumed by its need to process and recombine blood. I should never have talked to Emily about vampires. I never thought she'd actually try it without me. <sighs> Thank you, sir. Here, take this for your discretion. Goodbye, Sharp. She's been quite bit Holy shit! <laughs> That's a legendary weapon! Okay. How good is it? 35 stun, got 10 attack speed, 30 stamina. Fancy. Um, before I actually do that, I'm gonna go back here to Garden Square. I think that's what this is. Hold on. Fucking. I hate how like fast it moves. Good evening, old chap. I won't lie. When did you escape the? You know what? I know what you mean. I haven't had much time to think about the war either since my return. Of course. The epidemic, I bet you've been busy as well. Forgive me, Johnny, I, I didn't want to sound selfish. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Can you help me? Infection is everywhere these days. If you ever go to the park near that swanky house belonging to the Malanies. Yes? What about the Malanies? 
What about their house? Not enough noise for a big family with children. Not enough movement. Closed doors. What is going on in there? I wonder. You need some rest, Clarence. Hmm. Said near the far north entrance. That's south. North is this way. Entrance to a sewer. This ain't it. Well, actually, this is north. I'm confused. Hold on. Far north side, you'll there's an entrance. Okay. And where is the entrance? Is that it over here? Stupid newborn. <laughs> Holy shit, you are tough. You're mine. Your prey is mine now. I win. Here's the sewers. All right. 
Here we are. Sorry, I was looking at Reddit. I'm reading the the collectibles guide. Also, I, I got the stream to fix itself, which is exciting. Last episode was kind of poorly edited. You guys probably saw that. Also, probably didn't care, but... Mohammed, hey, how's it going, fella? Welcome to the stream. You missed the last episode we met the Escalon Club. Is my mic on? Yeah, it is. Alright. I think the first thing I need to do is give myself some more bullets. And then I need to increase my attacks. You just finished this game a week ago, man. You ran through it that fast? This is despicable. Well, I'm taking my time. I'm doing the side quests. I'm trying to get all the collectibles. You're kind of bored of it. Well, then, I guess you're just going to watch me. Oh, shit. Alright, let's see if I can do this my first try. Here you go, fella. I tried to do I tried to I don't know his attacks yet it annoys me that the same enemies appear even though you haven't killed a soul yeah well some of these guys are scripted like this guy will always be here I thought this guy just showed up because of my killing and choices. No, he's he's got a collectible. Oh shit! Uh, I will crush you. Well, can you not crush me? Yeah, no, he has a collectible. That's why he's so dangerous. I can do that too, motherfucker. Oh. You shall learn to respect the laws of Well, he clearly wasn't there at that meeting. Shit. You can't do nothing, my man. <laughs> Try to hit me, me boy. I'll eat you. I am Escalon, my boy. Ah, shit. Come on, first try, come on, come on. Almost. Here we go. Alright, take two. Oh. 
How about you give me yours? He's got the same size as like Mr. Shakedown from Yakuza. Oh shit. How about you, Neil? Come on. That was 1,000 XP. Awesome! I did that my second try too. 
Mohammed, if you're still here, you just you either watching or you just missed a really good boss fight. Well, he did say he was kind of bored of it. I can't blame him. I kind of played this for about three weeks straight. And then I did a one episode of Modern Warfare and I did one episode of uh, Dreams. Well. What is this? Some kind of puzzle. There we go. Hey, what? Oh, there we go. I don't know what that did, but hey, pretty cool. Found a rivet. These are level thirty. I am not going to get enough blood to fight these dudes. There we go. Fuck. That didn't work. Oh, for fuck's sake. They're not letting me reload. Hold on. Uh, pistol, 62, 40.
shit. And that is number two. I got better at parrying. That's him down. One more. I got this. I can do this. I'm epic. I got him. I win. I just beat two, I just beat four level 30 vampires at level 18. And it only took me like three tries. Epic. Now I just gotta lower the water. I'm curious now, what's behind here? Gotta be something good. It's a watch and a screw. Anything else? Louise. Somebody's trapped. I can't believe I'm doing this. Let is it? Go, you bastard! You're definitely gonna take a few tries to kill, I think. Don't worry, miss. I'll save you.
Shit, 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 shit. Haha, <laughs> got you. Nah. Almost. I almost did it. Alright. Well now I really gotta rescue this lady, because if she die if I if I leave, she dies. I can't parry fast enough. There we go. I got it down now. I need to do my fight damage. I win. Are you all right, Miss? Who are you? What do you want from me? My name is Jonathan Reed. I'm a doctor. What happened to you? Why are you here? I'm Louise Teasdale. I was kidnapped a few weeks ago by a vampire. Don't laugh, please, sir. It's no joke. I believe you, Miss Teasdale. That monster told me my father was dead, that no one was waiting for me outside. You're safe now. You don't have to worry about the vampire. You should just return home. Thank you, sir. I hope we'll meet again soon. Because I'd really like you to teach me how to get rid of these creatures. Goodbye, Miss Teasdale. And be careful. Until we meet again. I don't know your father, but I'm sure he wouldn't like to see you here. It My father was a great man who taught his daughter not to surrender without a fight. If he's dead, I hope he gave his killer a hard time. Goodbye. All right.
Is there any collectibles in here? Probably not. That just seems like a side quest. Yeah, she's alright. 